Hail to you, Rada followers! Today's album is a split album between three different bands. One from Germany, two from Finland. And as always with split releases, it's really hard to kind of, uh, kind of like sum it up how it is, because all bands have different approach, different history and all that stuff. So I'll do my best to give you a little bit of uh, insight by this uh, album called Essence of Black Mysticism. Now, this starts with Drudesang, four tracks, first intro, then a first proper track, then a kind of a interlude, which is kind of a martial percussion track, then another black metal track, and then we move on. Then starts Kalmangandaya, which is definitely the most known band, the only one with real albums here, like 12 or so, and then we finish this off with Heezy, a uh, small Finnish band that has put out only a couple of uh, smaller releases prior to this one. But without further ado, let's take a look at uh, how this Digipack looks like. So as you can see, very uh, simple Digipack, very kind of a classical output here is the logos and the tracks. As you can see, four tracks here, only one lengthy track here, and then a couple of ending tracks with Heezy. <clears throat> and obviously a CD underneath which there is a image but nothing much and we have obviously this booklet which first of all has kind of a regular symbols known to you known most of you i guess at least some way then we have this drudesang a five-man band from germany been out there for a few years but no albums out yet kalman kantaya part then again has just a minimal information here no band pictures but just like four atmospheric images from finland and then last but not least we have heezy with the main guy heezy here and there's also the recording information as you can see if this zoom actually works nicely and there we have it no lyrics whatsoever but then again split releases don't often do that not to mention regular ones So this starts with Drew Design, which seems to take most of the time here, but to be honest, this is very, very balanced in the sense that almost all the bands get pretty much roughly more or less the same amount of time here. Like I said, it starts with an intro, which is kind of easy to forget, and then starts Drew Design's kind of atmospheric black metal, which has a lot of potential, but I don't think it's just tapping into the potential fully just yet. The thing here it is, it's kind of a melodic, it's kind of atmospheric, but it's kind of a slobbily produced. I mean, all the sounds are pretty much like you could just have used better mixing, better recording, whatever, because everything is kind of like, not noisy, but kind of a weak. It's not really harsh, it's not really raw, but it's far from being just powerful and, you know, full of kind of a mass you know <clears throat> but it's it's quite okay i think drew design is here showing some real talent uh, they are nicely creating this atmosphere and it's very compatible with kalmanganda which follows just with one track 11 minutes or so and those who you know kalmanganda's previous works this doesn't really you know make that big a difference but it's i think it's from the better side of kalmanganda uh it's One lengthy track which starts with sort of its intro on its own, kind of like semi acoustic uh, guitar riff, and then soon starts a real metallic part where it goes just a little bit fast tempo and also creating this kind of a nice majestic uh, atmospheric stuff. But also with the same kind of problem that with Drew Design, the production is a little bit weakish. I wouldn't call it just weaker, crappy, right out, out of the bad, but. It's a little bit something that I think could have used some re real extra polish or just some boost, uh, boost, not boost, boost to the actual sound. But what makes this album the most is that those two tracks by Heezy, uh, one is a little less than six minutes and the other is six minutes plus, so overall about 12 minutes all in all. And these are very you know, more riff-driven songs. Some parts, are, some parts are more hypnotic type of person kind of things, but I think it's a little bit off. Uh, comparing this straight to person gives you a wrong idea. I mean, 
it is kind of very much like Burzum. I mean, Burzum has very much, very many tracks that are kind of a riff driven, but then again, it's more of these kind of hypnotic patterns as well. And he is basically the same genre, not just fully, you know, copycatting Burzum. I think both of these tracks are definitely the best tracks on this uh, split, and I think they are very enjoyable. Actually, they gave me the kind of hunger to get more Heezy. Now, I've heard Heezy's material before, and it was quite okay, but this is a different breed. It seems like the band has jumped to a whole new level, maybe even skipped some mid-level in between, because now this is real strong stuff here. Everything from, you know, uh, vocals to actual riffs, and even the production is, I think, more fitting to this music than with the rest of the bands here. But overall, this whole split is actually very nicely done. Even though Drew Design is, in my opinion, the weakest of links here, it doesn't mean it's weak as such. It's actually quite good. Kalman Ganda is maybe a little bit better, and he just takes the whole game, being the last band, which is always the nice, uh, in a nice order of you know tracks and bands, in my opinion, especially when we're currently split. Started with a little bit not so powerful songs and finish it with the best. I think that's the way to do it. But then again, there's no perfect way to create a split album. But overall, nice digipack with some nice bands and it's kind of like a business card. You get three different um, quite good bands with just one release. Not everybody is, you know, enthusiastic about splits. Me neither. Most of the time, but when you have like three nice bands on a single record, why the hell not? So give this one a go. There is a link which just takes you to the Bandcamp site with all the tracks there. And what can I see? Say, hope you enjoy them as much as I did. So go check out and let me know what you think. This is all from Rauta. See you soon with more reviews.